I see more medical practices offering hypnosis. Does it really work or is it just hocus pocus? Hypnosis is one of the oldest forms of psychotherapy. More than a form of entertainment, it's an approved form of treatment for relief of pain and anxiety. And for many people, it works very well. For example, researchers studied women who were taught before surgery how to use hypnosis to manage their pain. These women required less sedation during the procedure and experienced less pain, nausea, and emotional distress afterwards. All true hypnosis is really self-hypnosis, that is, you can only enter a trance if you want to. You are in control of the process, not the therapist. It is simply a heightened state of concentration that is similar to daydreaming or meditation. The therapist's role is to train you to use a variety of hypnotic techniques that combine relaxation and imagery to achieve that state. The aim is to eliminate distractions, turn the focus away from painful symptoms, and allow an openness to helpful suggestions. When it comes to hypnosis, it's actually better not to believe in magic. If you'd like to try it, you can have the best experience by choosing someone who is licensed by your state in a standard field of practice like psychiatry, psychology, or social work. And once you're underway, make sure you understand exactly how your therapist expects hypnosis to work for you. From Harvard, I wish you good health.